What does a Thatcher need do to an evil eye? You know, Fuse has been just carrying around this Fuse canister all day. Right now, I'm not saying that's suspicious, but I am backing you in a corner here. <laughs> Can you describe the one like key feature of that scope? It's trash. <laughs> 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 Actually, look good. Damn. I'm pulling up that oh, Pittsburgh Knights for the rip. Go for it. He's, he's got the night skin. He's got the night skin. That's what I want to show. You can see it. It's uh, looking, it's looking it. good. Basically, how it's going to work is uh, we're going to do three rounds. One of us in this, uh, in this circle here is an imposter. Someone does not play Siege. If you guys can find the imposter and vote them out, we're gonna give everyone a code to the Pittsburgh Night skin. So I know a couple of you guys just bought it this morning, so now your Smurfs are gonna be flexed too. Only if you get them out though, only if you get them out. But I have a feeling you guys are gonna be uh, pretty savvy with this. All right, so I'm gonna ask you, sorry, a couple of questions. So I'll ask you maybe three questions each, um, and I'll go by one by one by one by one on the left, and then um, at the end of round one, you guys can come to a decision as to who you wanna vote out. Starting with Ash. What is your favorite operator and why? I think it's Ash because, I mean, she's easy to pick up, her gun's easy to use. Nice, nice. And then what is your least favorite map? I'd have to say that's like Tower, because that map is just amazing. I can't even stand playing it in casual. Number three is, why do you like Siege so much? Why are you a Siege player? I, I think I like it a lot just because it's different than most other like popular first-person shooters. More beginner-friendly in my opinion. Okay, all right, well thank you for your uh, contributions. I'm not sure on you, to be honest. The sunglasses are a bit of a giveaway. So Glads, we're gonna run through the same questions. So uh, starting with who is your favorite operator and why? My favorite operator is Rook, and that is because uh, spawn picking. Are you, are you, do you consider yourself a, an expert in the spawn picking realm? Absolutely not. I'm terrible. <laughs> <laughs> you like to try. You like to try. All right, cool. And then what about your least favorite map? And uh, give us a, a quick reason as to why. Oh, Skyscraper. It was always annoying. Well, even the rework? Yep. I actually quite like the rework, personally. What got you into Siege, or why do you like Siege? And uh, yeah, why? Uh, my friends got me to get it for console. And that's where it started. Now you're here in a, in a strip club with the boys. Yeah. Uh, so moving on to Castle, I like the headgear, by the way. You're looking good. Looking good. Thank you. Okay, so uh, your favorite operator and why, my man? Probably have to be Mozzie. Why? Is because he just he does everything other than they took away his shotgun, so he can't make rotates. And then your favorite map and uh, least favorite map, sorry, and uh, why? Probably have to be Cafe. Uh, reason attacking Ooh. top on on ranked. Uh, only one viable strat, man. You uh, drop hatch or drop skylight. It does kind of suck on attack online. And then what got you into siege, dude? And uh, yeah, why you play? Uh, I got the beta, and so I was like, hey, this is cool. You're a beta kid. Is that is that uh, is that the know. absolute bait? Is he just trying to, you know, bait us? Maybe. Okay, all right, look, we're moving on, we're moving on. IQ, favorite operator That's and great. why? Uh, it's probably smoke, because I'm always the guy that plays smoke in my stack. <laughs> I have to have the site set up the way I want it, so whenever someone else picks smoke, and they don't like make the specific rotate hole or the specific sight line I want, yeah. which is like, so I just always pick smoke, so that I'm always- So the site plays out exactly. exactly how you want it. So which site do you like setting up? We're gonna change yours up a little bit. Kitchen coastline. And I just let my team frag everyone while I just throw smokes at service. Okay, we're moving on to then what got you into Siege and uh, yeah. One of my friends is on the team from my college and he said, you know, like, you should try out. So I did and I made it and I've just been like grinding Siege super hard since. Sick. Oh yeah. Uh, Mr. Jaeger. What's up? Favorite operator and why? Uh, I think I'm also gonna have to say smoke. Ooh. Okay. Uh, just because I feel like he can do it all. So he obviously sets up sights with the shoddy. He has an SMG 11, which absolutely shreds people. And then uh, what's your favorite map, my man? Uh, least favorite, least favorite, be... least favorite. Oh, least, My least, apologies. least. It probably has to be like Favela. Favela! Playing Favela back in the day in ranked used to be like miserable. Okay, it looks like we're about to run out of time yeah. here. I think we're gonna have to, to meet back and recruit. Maybe we can get a change of scenery. Where do you reckon we go now? I reckon we go to church and all go sit around the table. All right, now we're on Jaeger. Favorite Least map. favorite map was Favela, okay. And then now we're just down to the why. Did you get into Siege or what got you into Siege and why do you still play my dude? Well, I had always played like uh, Rainbow Six Vegas back in the day, like one and two. And then when Siege came out, I kind of just hopped on immediately. I've been hooked ever since. It's just, it's a, 
It's a unique game. There's there's no other FPS like it. Love tap you in the foot. Okay, moving on to Thatcher. Thatcher, favorite Hello. favorite operator. Favorite um, operator. so I have to go with Ash. I know someone already said it, but uh, I I just like Ash's loadout. I I don't know if this is unpopular opinion, but I really like the G36C. Um, and, and her breaching charges and all that. Nothing Again, to do very with easy to use, but... skin. Yeah, no, no, <laughs> nothing to do with that. <laughs> what is your least favorite map, my friend? Uh, Canal. Canal, that was, that was fast. That was fast. I feel like that's a that's a, definitely a shared opinion. Why why Canal, dude? Yeah, just like the spawn trapping and even after the re the uh, rework, I just d was never a fan of it. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna disagree. I'm not gonna disagree. You do look a bit sus over there, though. All right, so what got you into Siege, dude? And uh, yeah, why, why are you still playing? So I got into Siege about two years ago. A couple of my buddies were picked up and played it, and they recommended that I get it as well. It's a little bit slower, which I like, and I like the strategy aspect of it. It's not like um, some other shooters like Call of Duty where you just kind of run around. I, I respect it, man, but, you know, look, I'm, I grew up on COD, so be careful what you're talking about, okay? Uh, vigil down there at the end. I like your skins, by the way. You've been grinding the battle pass. Uh, who was your favorite operator? Sorry, this is real backwards. Who was your favorite um, operator? Bandit, because you know MP7 supremacy. Yes, and you don't you don't like helping the team with bandit tricking or anything along those lines. You just like actually, the... I am a yeah. pro bandit. Oh, say so okay, <laughs> all right. What is your uh, what is your least favorite map, mate, and uh, and why? Probably, I know someone already said this. Favela. Too many breachable walls. It's not fun to play in casual. 90% of the time, I'll leave. I'll have to agree with you there. And then, what got you playing Siege, my man? And uh, yeah, why are you still playing? Your eyes look so, really suspicious, by the way. I don't know if any of you guys can see oh, yeah. this. Maybe I'm you should come in a bit closer and, and check this out. This guy is sus. This guy is sus. One of my friends said, hey, you should try out this new game. See, I was just like, oh. And I found out it had been out for a while. Gave it a shot on console. Played for like two years. And yeah, now here I am. I'm just... I think that, uh, that draws us to a close. I believe. I'm um, not going to lie. I'm a little bit stumped. I don't know if you guys have any suspicions. Like I said, Ash won't uh, remove the sunglasses. Vigil's looking sus as all hell. Maybe it's the, the cheeky lesion on the table. No one's heard him speak, eh? Hmm. What's he doing? True. Yeah, I don't know. I guess maybe have like a little a little group discussion. Or, I'm just uh, going to say that the fact that uh, Thatcher said that he liked the G36. You, re you reckon that's just yeah, straight sus? Canal, yeah, yeah I, mean, I was like just kind of like... You know, what's wrong with that? that? Most yes. Ash players will always run the R4C. I rarely see an Ash. I do agree with that. I do I do run the I, R4C. I, I agree I, as personally, well. personally, like, it, it, like in real life, too, I also really like the G36C. So I will, you know, roll with that. I don't know. I think that's that's suspect number one there. That's suspect number one. Anyone else thinking anyone's fishy? What are we thinking? Uh, So, so hear me out, okay? Every single one of Ash's cosmetics you can buy right now. Okay, he's got <laughs> he's got velveteen on his pistol. Copper. He's got velveteen on his pistol. No, no, it's he's not velveteen. It. It's uh. Is that crimson? Like the, I think that... it's called the lembit. Okay, hold on, Ash. Ash, what did they take away from Jaeger? Uh, like... his speed and his A car. Okay. okay, yeah. All right, all right, all right. You may pass the test here, then. You may pass the test, even though you're sus. <laughs> <laughs> you, uh, you pass. All right, so uh, I can't remember where we were with the interrogations. Look, the reason that I pulled out Glass before is because, I'm not gonna lie, bro, you're looking kind of basic over here. What did what did uh, Glass have before they gave him banana vision? Nothing. He just had normal scope. Yeah. Can you describe the one like key feature of that scope? It's trash. <laughs> Boys, I, I think Fair we got enough. it. Can you, can you tell me about the tint of that scope? I don't even remember to be honest. All All right, right, we, got him, boys. we got him, we got him, we got him, boys. Tent. Yeah. Nah, I don't think it's enough. I, I don't even remember the tent. You know, Fuse has been just carrying around this Fuse canister all day. Right now, I'm not saying that's suspicious, but I am backing you in a corner here. <laughs> gonna have to interrogate you. Thatcher, we said Thatcher might have been sus, right? Mm -hmm. Thatcher has yeah. no trick. Yeah, but then we immediately went to Ash, and then we, and then okay, we like, right, we, on, we've gone on, around, on. we've gone around. Thatcher. We got, we got to make sure we get everybody yeah. first. Thatcher, I have a question for you. Thatcher, can you tell us the two ops? That counter line what, directly. What is that? <laughs> Why? Who shot me? He doesn't know hey. what it is. He doesn't okay. know what the spider is. This so... is a Thatcher question. Thatcher, how many rounds does the AR-33 have in it? What kind? I mean, I feel like that that's a, you know, rhetorical question. I feel like a more important question yeah. is. <laughs> well uh, uh why why are we not interrogating the person who wasn't even nah, here last that's, round that's the third time that thatcher has uh has deflected He's dodging thatcher why am i being shot at all right thatcher, thatcher here's, the, here's an easy easy question okay this is the easiest question of them all okay what does a thatcher nade do to an evil eye oh. 
Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Maestro Evil. Just Google on it. All right, we're gonna have to. We're gonna have to go to the wall. Uh, please fuse over here. I'm still sus on you, dude. You are, you are just, what is going on with that canister there? Oh, is he the cameraman? That is the cameraman. Yeah, he's the yeah. cameraman. Yeah. 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 Dude, that is yeah. so funny. I was like, what the fuck? No one's even interrogating him. If you have inten uh, suspicions that Thatcher is the man, we're going to have to step forward now, please. And is that your final vote? Yeah. Final vote? You're, you're happy yeah. to, to sacrifice the Thatcher? Yep. 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 I'll do it. Off the edge. I'll You're gonna have to off. walk off the edge, my man. Backwards, please. Backwards. <laughs> oh Look us in the eye as you go. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> and I think oh. that uh, that that brings us to our uh, conclusion. That man was Terry. definitely the imposter. I feel I feel like you guys are uh, you confident that you found the right man. Yeah, I think. Yeah. Oh. oh. I, think oh. I think I'm dead. So. Oh, nice black guy. <laughs> You're right, Pack. Yep, you are. Uh, I, I know, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm definitely not okay. Alright, so we don't have to boot up another lobby, guys. Well done. You have successfully identified the imposter. It was definitely the Thatcher. Good good effort. I think that the, the, the Maestro Cam one, though, was a bit of the, the golden bullet. The golden bullet. There was no coming back from that. Yeah. So, so Dom is just... He he works for the Knights. <laughs> he, Dom, tell them how much Siege you've actually played. <laughs> 27 hours. I'm ranked 27. I respect the game. For me, the biggest thing is like, I just don't like when people look through a one inch hole in the wall and I get headshotted and I'm dead. And I, 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 I can't even see them. I'm, I'm sorry I wasn't a better imposter. Uh, you, you did good, bro. You did good. Very, very fun. And enjoy the skins and uh, yeah, we'll, we'll see you next time. What is going on guys? My name is Dominic, AKA the Dominator um, online and in, as my gamer tag. Um, just wanted to chime in here really quick to let you guys know. Um, I'm a member of the Knight staff. We really we came up with this really cool idea with our content creator, Pac-Man Down Under, to do this um, Among Us style game type in Rainbow Six Siege, where we basically, you know, uh, there's an imposter among a group of people. We ask questions, yada, yada, yada. And you have to figure out who the imposter is and vote them out. And if you do so, you win. You know, we definitely had some, some really hardcore fans in this video, so. Uh, I definitely did my best to try to, you know, blend in and play the part. So I hope you guys enjoy it um, and go Knights.